got that a bit of stuff to bring in, to be honest. Watching basket up, it's come. Oh, have you ordered it one? My whole bought it on. I don't know. Oh, what are you doing? The lights and the lights are We're YouTubing. Hi guys, what's happening? <laughs> So I've just been to my mum's and got some more stuff, which is mainly plants, but we've got this laundry thing that my mum bought me, which is good. So that's gonna go in the utility room. And did you turn the washing machine back on? Yeah. So it should yeah. be washing yeah. my clothes? Yeah, yeah. Nice. The washing machine is working. Excuse my eyebrows, I had them done in there a bit. Um, red. So, yeah, it's a Thursday night and we are excited? Uh, tired. Tired. Tired is more of a word, I think, this week. I think next week will be more. Still excited, but. Still excited. This week's but struggles. Struggles. Struggles this week, and as you can see by my hair. Um, but yeah, so it's Thursday night, so I'm going to YouTube the weekend. <laughs> so we're starting on a Thursday night. Put my plants places, I don't know where. Um, but I just wanted to go and get them. And let me show you this little thing that my mum bought me this garden. Start yeah? Sure, can start cooking. It's. Um, the green bottle garden and it grows in that and you have to keep it on and it'll all grow up. If you can't tell, I love plants. Why is it so small? I mean, it is cute. Look at this. Let's take it into the utility room. Out with the old and in with the new. Look at that. It's like a laundry room. Callum's just cooked us up a fantastic storm. It just looks a bit like them plates make it look very underwhelming. <laughs> take a video of mine, mine looks way better. Oh. What? Oh. You're better than mine. No, it's not got two steaks, the plate looks fuller. Uh. So I've just put a plant up here, my string of hearts, but it's super knotted up on the transit, but I'll try and unknot it, but little things keep falling off. And then I've just put this little guy here, um, which this little plant has died and come back to life so many times. Um, and then I've just got this one. Here, I'm not going to keep it here, but I just don't know where to put it. I could just hang it on here. On here for now, I suppose. Just put him there for now. Please excuse all the disgusting curtains, like, they are going to go. Just leave him there for now. Clothes, these are going to be my wardrobes. Um, I've got all this and... This in here as well. And then I've also got these drawers. So that's gonna be a weekend job, but I am gonna include all that in this video as well, because I'm gonna like carry this on over the weekend. Um, so we're gonna fill the wardrobes. I'm gonna sort this room out quite a bit. Just try and get myself together um, a little bit more. Cause obviously we went straight back to work after Monday, after we actually moved in, both of us, we've just not really had much time to do anything, hence the state of May. We've got home from work, had tea, gone to bed. Um, tonight, like, I finished work, I've gone straight to home to get some stuff, come back eight, and now it's, like, already, like, eight o'clock, and we're knackered. Um, so, this weekend, I'm going to sort everything out, and, yeah, get, get video in. Yeah, so these are going to be my wardrobes, I need to make the spare bed up and do all that stuff. Um, all my clothes, I've got an, I've got another 
got another box full of clothes at my mum's and I've got clothes in there, clothes in the wood, in them drawers. So got a lot of clothes to sort out. So mommy and Helen bought this bowl and went to Ibiza in July. Um it's like I don't know, you know, like when you've got people around and you want to have a nice big salad or I don't know, it's just nice to have a big a big bowl. And I love things with patterns on like this. I'm gonna this my hair. So I'm just giving them a quick wash before I put them away. I've got these little cute ones which are so adorable. That's one of the things that I picked up. We've got so many bowls. I found these in a charity shop. They've got lids on. These were literally £2.50 each, I think. And I just thought they'd be just so cool with the lids on. And then in the set, you've got these two two size ones as well. I mean, we definitely don't need any more pattern bottles. really hard is find like working out where to put stuff I'm just really finding that challenging so initially we had our new plates in here but the cupboard wouldn't shut fully too because they're really big and we've got all our old ones in here so I'm like if we put this and put that definitely don't need all this all this crackly do I? Because I'm thinking of saving this one to put spices in. Do you know what? I'm just going to put them in there. They can be there for now, but I'm probably going to rejig it all because I just don't know. Wow! Wow! All the LEDs! In it? Cut out, Eon. On to percent of it. On to percent of it. They were fucking thriving off us. So you can change it with the remote? Yeah, I've also on. Oh. Oops. Nice. That's great, good. How come is that? Now, has your banana not on? Good morning, happy Friday. Thank God. One more day to get through work and then I've got the weekend um but i've just woke up and i thought i'd take you outside with me because i'm going to use my peg bag for the first time and i'm going to hang some washing on the line in the garden i have waited so long for this and i am so excited so let's go and hang some washing out which is so riveting but you know we're taking you along for the full journey Bags. My mum and my mother-in-law both bought me a peg bag. So now I've got loads of pegs. Yeah, these are the ones that are on hand, so. Just go and get some shoes on. Friday. We have just made these pizza things that we have, healthy pizza. And this is the first time we're using the well we're using the grill. Well, first time we're using it. It's exciting. To show what Callum's sister bought me. Look at that. How stunning is that? Do you know what? Actually I've got which matches. Yo, pumpkin spice. Pumpkin. Pumpkin spice. Look at that. How 
almost done in so yeah we're just gonna eat that and then we found the um remote for Callum's light so if you watched the flat videos you know we have this light and you can change the color on it so we had it on like a bright color so that's much better than take Callum yeah first time being able to enjoy enjoy our it. house enjoy our house in a week happy saturday Yo. what's our plans for today then callum jim you get your nails done and a few bits from on bargains and come back and do all the jobs that we need to do all week and pack everything and all pack. the box away we were meant and to be going to the races for callum's friend's birthday but we have, we're not going because... So Tim, Holly, if you're watching this, I'm really, really sorry, but I just can hear my voice, <laughs> very tired, and jobs to do and boxes to pack away. We've got boxes and we've just not had any time in, apart from in the evening when we're both knackered and then don't do anything to unbox things. So we're going to do that today and we're going to have a chilled day, aren't we, Carl? Too um, right. So I'm going to get my nails done and drop Calm off at the gym because this is the current situation and my toes look like claws. Rude. Frodo's toes. So yeah. I've just dropped Callum off at the gym and now I'm going to get my nails sorted which i'm so excited for you know like i don't know if anyone gets the toenails done but you know like when they start catching on things oh it's really really annoying sorry i really need to get a car stand for this camera i've only just managed to get one for my um phone but yeah so i'm gonna get my nails done then we're gonna go to b and m b and m b and m and then we're going to go home and sort my wardrobe out and I'm obviously going to video the whole thing and we're going to do it together and we'll go to B&M together. I'm not going to video in the nail shop because I'm not fucking whipping this camera out. Having a vlogging camera in comparison to sneakily filming on your phone is a different matter. But when I'm with Callum, I will get my camera out and we'll go to B&M together. Then we'll go home and we'll start organising my wardrobe, which I'm so excited for. Right, oh God, on these videos, I've just looked like a tramp the whole time. I washed my hair this morning and I didn't have time to dry it. Um, my nails are done, just gone for French and I got my toes done. I've just noticed this little coffee shop though. How do I zoom? You see it, it's called Gilmore's. Um, and I need to wait to go and get Callum. I might just go and get myself a coffee. Cause I'm fucking freezing. Should we go and get a coffee? Fuck it, let's go get a coffee. Okay, I'm back with my coffee. I was like, is this new? I've never seen it before. And he was like, no, we've been here five years. <laughs> oh. So I got a warm hazelnut latte. So let's do a taste test. Mmm. Good coffee. That's really good. Wow. Cheers to Gilmore's coffee in Sheffield, because that is tasty. I'm gonna go get Callum from the gym and then we'll go to BM. But I am hungry. But I didn't get anything in there because I thought Callum, we like to eat together. So we have to consult each other. <laughs> Little things that get me high. Won't you come with me and spend the night? Found it by choices that somebody else makes. Ah, oh, this is Bob. Only way to feed him is to sleep with a man for a So we've just come back to the house because Callum's dad is bringing us a table that we're going to use as a dining room table um, temporarily and then it will move outside until we get a bigger one still stunning though um but basically callum ordered a um doorbell a eufy show me the label of the um, eufy uh, this eufy security well we ordered a eufy doorbell basically and it's basically the same as a ring doorbell but it is um 
it was rated better than a ring doorbell so Callum wanted the Yufu one and it was about £180 for this doorbell set and then when it's basically come we have got all this stuff in it I'll show you so it's got um it's got three cameras in it and it's got this like intercom system so basically they've sent us a full like what is it like a security set basically like it's the book it's the next one up well it looks like they do their own security system for the, the, the like breakthrough ones the um doorbell and mm. obviously she got this is like a three camera security system so it's basically a camera security system that's worth like 450 quid 450 quid which we didn't buy but now we've got a full security system on our house and like basically you can talk to people through the cameras is that right or they yeah, yeah, you so can say like the doorbell, but you just get there's not actually like a ding doorbell it's, just, it's three security cameras so you can download the app on your phone and then um if you see people <laughs> So now we've got a full security system, which is hilarious, but I mean, it's worth a lot more money than what we paid. So thanks for that, Amazon. What should we call that? Um, the Watcher. Watching you. <laughs> what was that What was that Netflix? Was it called The Watcher? It was, oh, wasn't it? Really, really fucking horrendous. Don't, don't call it that. It's fucking, call I'm it. watching you. What's it called on um, fucking... They call them crows. Crows? Eagle eye. No, the fucking... <laughs> what? What? Watcher the Naughty? What do they call them? Jon Snow? What's the oh, um... Oh my God. Men of the... Uh, Night's Watch. Night's Watch. Night's Watch. <laughs> That's it. Go Night's on. Watch security system. So if you fucking try and come near this house, we'll batter you. You need to get through the door. We can handle these anyway. <laughs> If you don't watch Game of Thrones, then you won't get the <laughs> Night's Watch. <laughs> but if you do, then you understand. And we'll be fling-shotting stuff at you if you try and come down <laughs> south. Fling-shotting? Don't be like... Yeah, sling crossbow it. Bone arrow. Not fling <laughs> I'm not going to be doing any of that, clearly. But Calvin will. It's still on, mate. It's still recording. Oh, it's a bit delayed. Show me. It's like Christmas, Callum. So we've got a table. So this is Callum's dad is a steel fabricator. So he's obviously made the legs, and then this table is from old scaffolding boards. Um, but we're going to have this temporarily, then we're going to move this outside when we get our big one. Um, because this room is so so big like look how long it is we want like a long a long one um similar color though the one that we want because the sofas are dark brown as well so we want like a that kind of vibe but yeah so this is perfect for now and we're gonna get some chairs so at least we have somewhere to sit and eat our tea we're off out for some food before we go to b&m because i'm about to get hangry and nobody likes Georgia when she's angry. Yeah, but the thing is, you're, you're like joking about it and when you're... No, I'm being serious. No, yeah, but you see, like, you, you, your subscribers or whatever won't, and TikTok like, followers won't understand what you, how you actually change into a dragon. <laughs> and like, you, you, the, or the whole the whole personality changes and like your whole aura just goes hot, like nasty. I don't like you when you're hungry. <laughs> Like, not, that... not even a joke, like, I don't, like, you're not a nice person when you're hungry. <laughs> so, we have and to And I know I'm not. So, once I feel it coming... We have to top We up. have to, like, that has to be our priority, doesn't it? Top, yeah, yeah. So, it, when every, I got... Every, no matter what we've got on, everything has to be above. Because otherwise, it won't be enjoyable. Like, if we went to, like, B&M and I was hungry, I'd be horrible. And be I, I know I would. Be nasty, but not just, like, to me. You should be, like, nasty to other people. No. No. no, but you but like you, you judge you do you become like blunt like it's like blunt not nasty. Well, that's it. That's a different. But so yeah, no matter what we're doing, we have to abort and just right top George up with food, and then once that's done, like she literally, literally not even. That's joking, my first mouthful. She starts in shot smiling. <laughs> but we, we would usually go to my mum's cafe, but it shuts at one and it's half twelve, so we're not going to be them people that turn up when yeah. they want to shut. Even though they would welcome us. They would welcome us with open arms, but 
So we're going to try a place that we've never been to before and then we're going to go to B&M &M, and we also want to see if we can find a new bin. Yeah, new bin. Maybe. Big, 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 big bad boy big bin. Big bad boy bin. <laughs> <laughs> we'll have to get a big bad boy bin. Yeah, but it's not worth having a stingy bin that gets no. full. We're going to go to a cafe, but it was full, so we've got a berries. But berries is just a Sheffield thing, isn't it? Yeah. Chelsea, who lives in Grimsby, didn't know about berries. Never know. So if you've never heard of berries, um, if you ever come to Sheffield, you need to get them. I got them. Mmm. I've never heard a bad one. You just slap every time. Oh. oh, look at her. Wow, oh, a little dress on. I've got an egg custard and a, a cornflake one. Do you mm. like egg custards? Yeah. For a cornflake one, though. <laughs> well, that's yeah. why I got a cornflake one as well. <laughs> Alan does this thing where like, if you're eating something, he eats the worst bit first and he'll eat like in an order. So like if you're having a Sunday dinner, for example, and you've got veg, potatoes, meat, he'll eat the veg first. Then he'll like go on to maybe the Yorkshire puddings. Then maybe no. he'll go on to like the roast potatoes and then he'll save the meat till last. Um, I've got a full circle on the last one, mate. Like, <laughs> all the meaty bit is that. You can just fucking... No, mate. Oh, my God. I wish I bought a meat. Look at that. Yes, I do. Yeah. No, no, it's in the best thing. <laughs> now then. I'm going to be an advert for berries. Mm. Berries? Berries? You want to sponsor me? Berries? <laughs> you want to sponsor me, berries? There was a towel spy. Got to get some more because we only bought three, which was silly. Um, right, now we're in B and M. Just getting some bits. What do we need from here? We'll just get some toothpaste. Look at all the Christmas stuff. What the hell? It's nice though. I know it's not Christmas yet, but that is so nice. Are we allowed to buy Christmas decorations yet? Oh, look at all these. Look at him. So cute. Hello, the future Georgia here coming with a voiceover because I accidentally recorded all of my haul in slow motion and with no sound so this is just my mini haul that I've managed to speed up with some of your great ideas so from HomeSense we got a new knife set we got a bin for the bathroom and we got these big ice cube tray holder things which produce the best most satisfying ice cube holders um, I can't remember what else I show next because clearly I'm just doing this as we go. Oh yes, I got these utensils for my kitchen which are obviously going to match the vibe of the kitchen which is stunning. Um, and then, oh we got a toilet brush. So when we decorate the bathroom we want it to be like a gold, black, uh, white, cream vibe. Okay, haul carrying on. Just a pre-warning that I did record the rest of all the video in slow motion with no sound either. So I'm trying to gonna edit it the best I can. Um, so I got this kitchen roll holder for the kitchen. I got this Le Creux set, however the hell you say that, um, utensil pot holder. And I know all their stuff is super expensive. So I'm buzzing with that. Oh, that's me just demonstrating how the utensil's gonna look inside of it. And obviously that matches my Smeg toaster and kettle. I got some new grabbers oh and she's demonstrating again this is so great to watch back then we got oh, a, a shower squeegee thing to clean the glass obviously sticking with the gold theme and that was also from home sense um and now we're gonna wait to see what we go on to next so drum roll please 
Oh, we're not sure. She's leaving you on a cliffhanger. Right. I'm not sure. Okay, and then I got from B&M, I got these vacuum storage packs because this video was going to be me reorganising my wardrobe and sorting my spare room out. But like I said, I recorded all that in slow motion, so that's great. But I did do a full TikTok on it in case you care. Then from Dunelm, I bought two more. Well, I bought a full-size towel and a hand-size towel because we have already got these, but we only bought three and I want a four. Um, I don't know what's going on there, but I just wanted an even number. And then we got this bath scrunchie, which is so cute. Usually these are really ugly, but this one was really cute. Okay, and then I did go to Ikea as well. Um, we got these two cushion covers uh, to go in the living room on the new sofa, because that is due to come on Sunday, actually. And we want like a, it's a chocolate brown colour, and we want that to be... Um, with like cream cushions and stuff so we thought these would match perfectly and then I got some storage containers because there's some drawers in my spare room so I'm gonna like put my makeup and all little bits like that in it okay so I've managed to put this to like a normal speed so I'm just gonna do a little bit of a voiceover part so I started off in the spare room with sorting out all my clothes if you don't know I have lived between Callum's and my mum's for like two years so I've literally had clothes everywhere so this was a very overwhelming job for me um but we just started off by trying to organize things out and I was trying to just do it in sections I did have a mini meltdown halfway through and had to have a quick break um but this bottom drawer is just full of work clothes that's quite a boring drawer um oh that's freezing a little bit and I'm not really sure why um okay and then I had this little box and I used this for uh, just gym wear because I go to the gym all the time lol joke then this was actually the next day and this is me just talking to the camera to say I'd been to my mum's to get another box of clothes and found some jackets hung up in my sister's wardrobe which is hilarious so I've got my clothes back now eBay haha <laughs> Um, I've got this trench coat from Primark which I've had for like a year and I found this in my sister's wardrobe as well and I actually forgot about this so I'm very glad to have my hands back on my coats. So we just sorted through this monstrosity of a mess um, but honestly just wait for the final product you are going to be shocked at how amazing it looks. So yep, just sorted through everything here. So I've just been editing this video and realised I've recorded all of Saturday basically in slow motion and there's no sound and I can't get it back. And so that basically, I my haul of everything that we bought is not included. My whole wardrobe organisation video is not fucking included. Um, our trip to Ikea is not included. I'll show you the bedroom, um, the spare room, what we did get done. So we got, I got this Le Creuse set, set um, dish from Home Sense, and I got these utensils which match the kitchen. And then we got this uh, kitchen roll holder. And then we got some new knives. But we got this plant the other week um, and I finally went to get it from my mum's. Um, so that is very exciting. Love that plant. I've also put these flowers in a vase. My friends got me this vase from Oliver Bonus and I am obsessed with it. Uh, we got the... TV stand from Callum's nan up. Um, she gave us that and that is literally stunning. I'm obsessed with that. We went to Dunelm and we already have these towels but we only got three and I wanted a fourth one because it was kind of pissing me off that we only had three. And I also got this little bath scrunchie. And then from Home Sense, I got this gold shower squeegee thing is it squeegee have i made that up and then in ikea because we did go to ikea i got we got these can't really see the color cream cushion covers to go on our new sofa so if you've come from tiktok then you'll have probably seen this bedroom anyway but we've got this big mirror here and then 
in these well, in these drawers I've got my makeup and I got these little container things from Ikea and then this has got like everyday stuff, deodorant, hair care that I use everyday, my brush, my hair oil, stuff like that and then this one's got more stuff that I don't necessarily use as much like fake tan, some film cameras from a Polaroid um, and then wardrobes so in this one I've got like tracksuits, uh, tops that need hanging, some jackets, some jumpers and then under here I've got gym clothes that never get worn, some pyjamas that I don't wear as much and some not as nice jumpers and I've got some bags and then in this one I've got underwear and pyjamas and then in this one, whoops, already too full, I've got like basic tops, joggers and shorts, definitely don't need any more like jogger shorts or casual shorts and then in this one I've got work clothes and I've got my Levi's and denim skirt. I did put all my um I did put all my summer stuff in um bags and they're in vacuum bags in the loft. I did show you in the loft but like I say that's footage has gone. But I'll show you that another time. We've got years in this house to show you around. And then in this side We've got like more dressier dresses that I might wear. I don't know, it's just some nice dresses. Jeans and trousers, trainers, and then up there, just again, some random shit, some shoe boxes, my rollers, like little travel bags. And then um, I'll turn the lights on for the sake of the video. Cute. So I have made this, I did make, I made this bed up so the spare room, got these lamps from my mum's house and some bedside tables. It... And then, and then we got Callum's gaming desk from Ikea. That's, uh -huh. We've missed all the footage in Ikea. Missed all the footage, but look, we've got a final piece now. Look, well, that's Callum. Hello, Callum. Hello. So yeah, I'm going to end, <laughs> obviously end the video here. I've already done an outro the other day. For some reason, the only thing that worked is the last clip that I did on Sunday, which is me saying, thanks for watching. Um, but yeah, this is all the learning curves of YouTube. It's very new to me and I don't really know how to do it. But yeah, so it's Monday night now and I'll have this video up for Tuesday instead. Um, so yeah, it's looking a little bit cosier and like I say, we're getting the sofa on Sunday, so that's exciting, um, but yeah, thanks for watching and I hope you still enjoyed the video, even though it was a big fat fucking fail. If you are from YouTube and you want to see my wardrobe transformation, then head over to my TikTok because I did film that for my TikTok, which wasn't as in-depth as it was on YouTube, but that's fine. Um, okay, bye.